The person who's won the game knows who the saboteur is. Is Corey. Oh, I was right. <laughs> Aiden. Aiden, and where are you from? I'm from San Mateo, San Mateo. California. Oh, great. Uh, was this your first bat show? Have you seen many bat shows before? I've seen many bat shows right. going back to 10 years ago when I was in high school. Amazing. Tell us about the show that you saw tonight. It was new, fresh, riveting, unexpected, and 100% enjoyable. I'm Jenny Gosen. I took my first class to a UC Berkeley extension. I fell in love with it. I teach kids uh, all week improv, and I love the fact that you have to have teamwork and cooperation on stage to make the magic happen. And I will not be the saboteur. <laughs> yes. An experience you'll never forget and it really makes you think about improv. And it's a new way to enjoy improv. The main ingredient is, well, water. <laughs> it's fun to analyze how the, the performers are interacting with each other. A big secret? <laughs> yes, a big secret, so I wasn't Gonna tell <laughs> me? I'm sitting right here, moron! <laughs> and it's, I feel like it goes a little deeper than a typical improv show where you're just enjoying the scenes and the relationships that the performers are creating. And the saboteur brought in an extra element of thinking about who's not just trying to work with everyone. I bet there's there's like no other dogs in the world who have their eyeball on the shoulder. Actually, there are. They're under my bed. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, it's interesting when someone says no in a scene, that could actually be yes anding if that's going along with the, the flow of the scene. Hayden, thank you so much for your feedback. Of and your course. Yes. Be my friend. This is not real! This is not real!